Uh, you guys, it's Beth here, and I'm so excited to finally have the time to film some videos today. Um, so my Thanksgiving break has officially finally started. Um, I have a few virtual teacher work days this week, um, but I actually was able to get everything done that I needed to prior to those teacher work days so I get the chance for rest and relaxation um, hopefully I'm still planning to prep a few things for school and work on work just a smidge but not too much and so I am excited and ready to just take a break I have some Christmas movies in my Netflix list that I want to watch I have um, a hair appointment today I need to schedule an eye appointment and I also set up a day that I can visit my kids and my cooperating teacher from when I did student teaching um, last or like the first half of the year. So I'm really, really excited to do all the all those things and then also I'm planning to finish up my Christmas shopping um, during this week and hopefully not have to worry about any Christmas shopping anymore, especially with um, you know, after Thanksgiving, I feel like most people start their Christmas shopping. So I feel like if I get it done before Thanksgiving, hopefully the stores will be like a little less crowded and less overwhelming and stuff like that. Anyways, this is not why you guys are here to hear a whole rundown of my life, but, um, I am here to share with you what I have been melting and I am so excited. It hasn't been a lot, but I'm still excited to share my thoughts. So I have two empties. Oh, here comes Ripley. You probably can hear his little paws on the floor. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Um, so first off, my first empty is Sensi's Scary Good. Oh, sorry about the glare. Not sure how to make it any better. But there is Sensi's Scary Good, and it is completely empty. And this was a good scent. But I do not think that it was a favorite for me, so I wouldn't repurchase it. But it was really, really good, and I enjoyed it. And if I did happen to get it again, then I wouldn't be sad about it. Yeah, that one was good. I definitely liked Give Me Candy more, though. Okay, the next one is that Smell Good Shop Donut Holes and Fluffanutta in uh, one of these little scent cups. And... Honestly, I didn't get the best performance from this, but it is all the way from 2020. Um, so it's almost uh, two years old, and it's from December 14th of 2020. So it's an old one, and yeah, I probably wouldn't repurchase that one. I'm glad I was able to give it a try. And then that's it for the empties. So this next one is Satsuma from Rose Girls, and I made myself a sample of this one and then gave the rest away in a like neighborhood giving group and yeah this scent is very very strong cleaner orange and my brother has been cooking with garlic and onions in the house and then it makes the whole house smell like garlic and onions and so I actually used this one to like try to overpower that scent it did do a pretty good job if I'm being honest so Maybe I would repurchase that one um, as long as I continue living at home um, just for, you know, days when my brother cooks something that I maybe don't like the smell of. Then I can have a scent that drowns it out um, a little bit. So, yes. In the bedroom from that Smell Good Shop, I melted the scent Pinhead. This scent is amazing. I absolutely love it. It's lavender, mint, and mallow. It is so good and I get great performance from it. And I'm excited to continue to use it and finish it up hopefully this year. I still have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, well, 8, 16, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. I still have 29 cubes left to use. Okay, next up in the bathroom, I melted this scent. This is Huntington Home Sun-Dried Linen, and this was given to me from Angie. Her channel here on YouTube is Kentucky Waxy Girl. I really enjoyed this one in the bathroom. I melted just one cube, and I'm excited to finish up 
um, these last three cubes. This one was a good one, and I am thankful for it. And then um, Southbound Candle Co. Witch Please. This scent is so good. One of my all-time favorites. This one is Crunchy Caramel Brittle Salted Peanuts Toasted Pumpkin Seeds and Vanilla Buttercream Cupcakes. This is so good. I love it. Um, I probably will melt it like one more time. And then I am going to give the rest away to someone special. So excited for that and then last but not least this is one that i'm so excited that i finally got to melting it's the one i have going right now and i've literally had it in my warmer since like i want to say wednesday um because it's just it just keeps on going and going and going i mean i haven't had it on like all day every day but i've definitely turned my warmers on like for probably about four hours on Wednesday, probably about four hours on Thursday. And then now today I've had them going for like three hours and it's still going strong. This is the scent, A Very Mario Thanksgiving in the Mario Melters from Rose Girls. This is sweet potato, royal sugar cookie, pie crust, caramelized pralines, and sweet pumpkin pie and a sprinkle of marshmallow. This one I'm definitely bringing to the beach with me. I'm going to melt it on Thanksgiving Day. Um, this scent is so good, which was very surprising to me because when I smelt it in the bag, I really didn't know what to think about it. So when she did her Mario Melter, uh, no, her Mario Mini Melter pre-order because she didn't do the Mario Melter size this year, but just the Mini Melter size. But whenever she offered it this year, this scent was available again. And I didn't pick it up because I wasn't sure how I felt about it in the bag. But on warm, I like love it. So next year, I definitely will be repurchasing a very Mario Thanksgiving. And I'm excited to warm it again before this year is over. So that's everything, you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. I know I haven't melted through a whole ton of stuff, but I think this week I will just because um, I have, like, a lot of time at home for this week. So, yeah, I am excited. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time, and as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.